वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स राइट द रूल्स फॉर साइन कन्वेंशन सो द फर्स्ट साइन कन्वेंशन ऑल द डिस्टेंसेस शुड बी मेजर्ड फ्रॉम द पोल सो वॉट एवर द डिस्टेंस इफ यू आर मेजरिंग द डिस्टेंस मस्ट बी मेजर्ड फ्रॉम द पोल सो दिस इज द पोल द ऑब्जेक्ट डिस्टेंस इमेज डिस्टेंस और वॉट एवर इट मे बी द डिस्टेंस मस्ट बी मेजर्ड फ्रॉम पोल वी नीड टू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम पोल so this is the first sign convention and the second one the distance which is measured in the direction of incident light ray then that value is taken as positive if the distance measured opposite to incident light ray then that value is taken as negative for example here this is the direction of incident light ray let us say this is the object situated here then if you want to measure the distance of the object we should start from the pole and we are measuring in this direction and this distance is said to be distance of object so here we are starting measuring of this length from pole but we are moving opposite to incident light ray the incident light ray is towards right side and we are measuring towards opposite to that so the this distance of object is taken as negative whatever the distance distance of object distance of image focal length radius of curvature any distance if it is measured in the direction of incident light ray if it is measured in the direction of incident light ray then that is positive if you measure it opposite to incident light ray then that is taken as negative for example here image is from we are we are measuring this distance in the direction of in this is the direction of incident light ray we are measuring this distance in the direction of incident light ray so this is taken as positive value whatever the distance measured in the direction of incident light ray then that is positive and opposite to that that is negative and next third sign convention the heights of the object the height of an object or image which is above the principal axis this is principal axis if it is above the principal axis then that height is taken as positive if the height is taken if the height is below the principal axis then that height should be taken as negative value whatever the height whether it is object or image if we measure above the principal axis that is positive that height value is positive if it is below then that value is negative find the distance of the image when an object is placed on the principal axis at a distance of 10 cm in front of a concave mirror whose radius of curvature is 8 cm so here the distance of image is given and the radius of curvature is given and asking to calculate for the distance of image so here the mirror is concave mirror let us say this is the pole focus and center of curvature and the distance of center of curvature is 8 cm and the distance of object is so let us say this is the position of object and the distance of object is given 10 cm which means so this is the distance of object which means the object is placed beyond c outside c so here the distance of image generally taken as u and it is 10 cm so here i am measuring i am taking it is negative value because we are measuring from p and opposite to incident light ray so this is the way of direction of incident light ray we are measuring opposite to incident light ray that's why the distance of object is minus 10 cm and radius of curvature this is the radius of curvature then it is minus 8 cm it is also measuring opposite to incident light ray then we know that 
the radius of curvature equal to double of focal length so focal length equal to radius by 2 so minus 8 by 2 2 1s are 2 4 so minus 4 centimeters is the focal length for this 4 centimeters is the focal length for this concave mirror then we need to calculate the distance of image so we know that 1 by f equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u substituting the values we know that f is nothing but minus 4 centimeters and we don't know the distance of image and distance of object is minus 10 and from this we can write that well, minus 1 by 10 is taken towards LHS left hand side so it becomes plus 1 by 10 minus 1 by 4 and remaining 1 by V and LCM so 20 10 2 are 20 2 1s are 2 minus 4 5s are 20 5 1s are 5 and 1 by V next so 3 by minus 3 by 20 it is 1 by V so inverting the equation V equal to minus 20 by 3 which is 6.67 minus 6.67 centimeters so this is the distance of the image so when the object is placed beyond C then the image is formed between F and C so here the distance of C is 8 centimeters and the focal point is focus is at 4 centimeters so the distance of image is 6.67 centimeters in between these two and next the magnification product by a mirror is plus one what does it mean so if magnification is plus one it means that the image is formed by a plane mirror and the image is virtual image and the distance of the image and object the distances of objects and images are same from the mirror and the heights of the images and object image and object also same and similarly if magnification is minus one then what does it mean if the magnification is minus one and the image is formed by concave mirror and the distance of image and the distance of object is both are same if you place the object on C then the image also formed on the C in case of concave mirror so here the position of the mirror these two are instant light uh, this is the image we know that the magnification is minus v by u here v is the distance of the object and u is the distance of the image so here the distance of the object is minus u because we are measuring opposite to instant light ray. the distance of the image also negative because we are measuring the light direction of the instant light ray is towards left and we are measuring right side so both are negative so both are same that is equal to radius of curvature minus r by minus r so equal to radius of curvature the distances of object and distances of image so both get cancelled then the value is minus 1 so if magnification is minus 1 then the object is placed on c before a concave mirror and the distance of image and distance of object are same and the sizes of the image and objects are same this is about magnification